These images from northern Sweden present the tired gasp of a dying world. The smell of rotten eggs. Hydrogen sulfide and methane wafts through the air. These swamps were once hard ground covering permafrost, a thick subsurface layer of soil that remains below freezing point throughout the year. Now, the permafrost is melting. 70 kilometers away on the south peak of the Kebnekese Massif, Nenes Rosquist is witness to a change that stalks the world. The mountain glacier has shrunk by more than 20 meters since the 1970s. And the temperature in the summer when it's melting is more important than, than the snow that comes in the winter. And we've had really warm summers, heat waves really, and that has eaten off the glacier so much. The world is warming. Here in the Arctic, the average annual temperature rose by 3.1 degrees Celsius from 1971 to 2019 compared to just 1 degree Celsius for the planet as a whole. Thawing permafrost and melting glaciers are a ticking time bomb, say scientists. Between carbon dioxide and methane, permafrost contains some 1700 billion tons of organic carbon. Now as it melts, these greenhouse gases are being released into the atmosphere. Closer at home, melting permafrost is compromising the foundations of homes and infrastructure in general. These changes now threaten the hard-won Paris climate goals. When the world vowed to cap the rise in global temperatures at well below 2 degrees Celsius, they did not take into account the rapid discharge of greenhouse gases from natural sources in the Arctic. Scientists warn that it may soon be too late. Climate change is here and with it, extreme weather events. In 2020, a record 55 million people were displaced and about $20.5 billion lost in damages due to extreme weather events. 2021 saw some of the worst wildfires. The European Space Agency reports that wildfires now burn an estimated 4 million square kilometers of land every year. Cyclones have become ever more powerful and frequent. So have heat waves and droughts. Six years ago, the world made a vow to stop climate change. Is that pledge being ignored? <laughs> 